park today. And <laughs> it's not even in the picture talk, Mom. <laughs> it's not. Well, they're helping me make a video today. Okay. <laughs> and, and giving me a struggle because they love sticking their hands and crap in front of it because they want to feel like they're a part of the production. Hey! They're making me laugh about the whole thing. So I was laying here, I was actually just looking up through this tree that I'm sitting underneath while I'm reading this book about filmmaking, of course. And uh, it's called The Real Truth by Reed Martin. And I was just reading about the struggles and difficulty a lot of filmmakers go through. Now you as a filmmaker, I can't imagine that you've ever experienced this, have you? No. <laughs> so, so what I'm here to talk to you about is as I'm reading this book and staring up through this tree, um, I started noticing some interesting things about this tree here. Okay, so we're, we're looking at the tree and there's all these branches and twigs and you know, great big huge logs and the base of the tree with some awesome garbage in it, you know, whatever. And as I was laying here, I changed my perspective just a little bit and saw the sun coming through like really brightly. There it is, right there. So I saw the sun coming through really brightly and got Hi. to thinking about how this applies to you as a filmmaker. As you're creating your film, and as I was just reading in the book, you're going to come into many, many obstacles that um, make it kind of hard for you as a filmmaker to to get your films funded and get all to make sure all the the information you need is in there, and that when you take it to a potential investor, um, that you're going to be able to. Children are driving me crazy, and they're helping, aren't they? Yes. <laughs> but so this is just like filmmaking. Like, how many times do you have all these distractions and oh things God. that are in the way? And sometimes filmmakers do funny things. Like, they decide that filmmaking is way more important than, than their relationships with their wife or their girlfriends. They... They give up on jobs that they have and think that they're just going to go out and make their film and make it big. Well, the issue is, is they're missing so many pieces in the film world that if they quit their job or drop those relationships that are actually a great outlet and a great place to be supported, they are setting themselves up for failure. So as a filmmaker, sometimes, even though there are branches and trees and twigs and leaves and whatever. If you just take a second and change your perspective, and there it is right there, the sun shining through. When you change your perspective through all that muddle, you actually can see the light coming through. So what I encourage you to do is add your name to the email list so that we can continue this conversation and uh, click on the link below so that we can chat a little bit more and remember live laugh love everyone's watching <laughs>